And so your lie doesn't show up on the main page for some reason. Chaka girl. <laughs> Yes, I ordered from CVS on DoorDash. Okay, good. Thank you. I tried Fufu because of you. It was real good. Oh, really? Because a lot of people, um, a lot of people don't like uh Fufu. Hello Fresh or Factor. Okay. Grizzly is good. Drizzle. Bring it. Okay. Yes, DoorDash does it. Used to work for them. Okay, good. Well, I think I'm gonna get that then because Uber Eats is really trying my patience. And I'm about tired of them. What was that? Oh, y'all. Uh, should I say that? Nah, I ain't gonna say it. It was about my neighbor. I ain't gonna say it. They might watch me. It's nothing bad. But uh, I had my first run in with my neighbor, y'all. But I'ma just let it be. Cause I don't want no mess. But we had our first run in. It wasn't bad. It was a little light light. Her husband was real nice, but she just wasn't feeling me, I guess. But it's okay. We'll be alright. You gon' you know you gotta bump head with your neighbor one time. <laughs> we had a run in, girl. And I was just like, girl, I'm like, oh, you gotta be so extra. Let's just relax. Hello. A CP. Hey, somebody, what can I get for you? Y'all doing breakfast or lunch now? No, we're on lunch. Relax. Okay, hold on. Let me see, friend. I don't want no dead meat. Oh, this is dead meat. Can I just do the tenders? I do the five piece with. Um, can it be a meal with the fries? All right, the five piece meal. What's the drink? Sweet. Um, do you got you got sweet tea and unsweet tea? You said that sweet tea. I want it half and half though. All right, we don't have one sweet, though. What? We got lemonade. It's the black area. Okay, um, just do lemonade. All right, with the lemonade, what's the difference? Barbecue. All right, is that all for you? Yes. All right, 1025. All right, thank you. Girl, no unsweet tea. Oh, this is the hood, honey. Where do I live? I need to rethink my location, girl. Obamacare. Oh, I'm in the project. I'm just playing. Um, damn. I be hating when oh god, y'all see I got these small extras. I be hating when places don't have sweet unsweet tea. KFC don't have unsweet tea either. Well, over here they don't. I don't know about where y'all live at, but they don't have unsweet tea. That is really something. Not the hood, yeah, girl. I think I live in the hood, girl. They over here washing cars out of an old van, girl. Yeah, I'm in the hood. Look, let me show you. Don't y'all laugh about where I, you know, you know, don't laugh where I come from, girl. It could be you. <laughs> don't laugh at where I come from. It could be you. Oh, God, they're washing the cars out of the old truck. Look, oh, Jesus, this is my life. It's okay. Somewhere out there, my life will change for the better. Girl, my life is where it's supposed to be. Shut the hell up. I'm good. Five, 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 five. Ooh. Y'all, can you, um, uh oh, the curb. Can you, um, put, like, your business name on a credit card? Or no, oh, God. Can you put your name on a business card? Like, you know, Goddamn's Old Productions, or no. You can. Because I don't be liking to go and swipe my card and it be having like, you know, my last name on there. Because people know my first name, but I don't be liking to have your last name on it. You know, people be, um, then they got, you know, I just, cause, okay, good. So I'm going to go, because I got a business card, but it's my name on it. So I'm going to change it to my business name. They're not going to ask for no ID, is they? Because <laughs> I'll be like, this is the business card, girl. What is you saying? Good. Okay, I'm going to do that. I'm going to do that. 
Anybody in Atlanta know where you can get a colon cleanse? As long as it's a business account. Okay, good. Got it. Where can anybody in Atlanta know you can get a colon cleanse? Like where they put that tube in your butt and then it sucks out all the, um, it sucks out the doo doo and everything. Like it puts the water in you and suck it out into that little machine on the side. And then you can look at the machine and see everything that came outside your body. You wear earrings though? Yeah, I do. As long as it's a busy, okay. <sighs> yeah, my mama got, got one on Buford. Oh, y'all hear my music? The colonic. Yeah, I need that. I just want to get it done. No, not a detox. It's like a, what they do is, it's a tube. And they lay you down. And they, yeah, a colonic. I want that. They put it in you. And then, um, it pushes, I think, water in your body. And then it, like... All of a sudden, it sucks it out. And, like, it sucks out all the waste that was in your intestines and everything. And I want to get that done because, like, I eat a lot of meat. I eat, like, a lot of meat. And I just feel like this little gut I have, I feel like it's just, like, waste. I don't feel like I'm fat or anything. I feel it's, like, just waste just sitting there. Like, dead meat from a long time ago just sitting there doing nothing not a colonoscopy girl that's a what that's a medical procedure <laughs> somebody said an enema uh uh you do those I do those weekly <laughs> you do an enema weekly girl that's weekly girl I cannot see did you hear me fine ass? Uh, girl, hush. Don't say I'm not fine. I want to... No, dude, it's so good. Dead meat. Yeah, like right now, I'm going to eat some chicken tenders and I shouldn't even be eating them. I don't know what I'm doing. I'll be damned. Right, why? Colonics. Where your food at, girl? I'm the third car. Hey, Zo. Hey, Sunflower. Let me meal prep for you. Are you in Atlanta? Is your food good? You can't let everybody cook for you because sometimes, like... I don't let y'all give me all them crystals and stuff. And then I started hearing voices in my house. And that's really scary. So I had to sage and stuff. Yes, detox maybe. Baby, I done did every detox. Uh, detox, it, I don't feel like detox actually cleanses your colon. Like, it get it out. But I don't think it get it, get it out. Like, go Google what a colonic is. You're going to be like, oh my God. God, people even lose weight after that shit. Like, I've done, done the Arden Garden Detox, where you all you could do is drink that juice for, like, two weeks. Um, and, um, it, you know, it's the two-week juice or whatever, and that's all you can drink. You can't do no water. You can't do no food, no chewing gum, no nothing. I used to do that, and, child, um, it didn't, it did something, but it didn't really do what I wanted it to do. You know what I'm saying? I want that tube to go in there and suck out everything. Like, it sucks out everything. Like, you look at that little thing, you see stuff from years ago. You may be like, oh, my God, I remember I swallowed that marble when I was 10 years old. It's going to be something like that. That's what I need. I want that thing. I want that. Like, I want to pull it all out. Just get it out of me. Get it out of me. Not a baptism. <laughs> Somebody said I'm getting a baptism. <laughs> a baptism. Oh my God. Y'all is stupid. But, um, 
Yeah, I, uh, I, the reason I said marble because I did. I swallowed a marble a long time ago when I was a kid. I swallowed a marble, being stupid, put it in my mouth and just gone, girl. Marble gone. And I used to, I was crying because I was like, oh, I'm going to have to poop that out. And I was like, it was going to hurt. I was so scared. I had to poop out a marble. But I don't think it ever came out. I guess the acids in my stomach made it disintegrate or something. And that's so funny. Like, why did the marble disappear? But the marble disappeared, but chewing gum don't. Like, you can see when you poop out chewing gum. You be like, oh, there go that piece of gum. You be like, oh, they got that piece of gum. <laughs> like, you done forgot about it. It could be like a whole three, four months later, and then you be like, that's that gum I swallowed. I don't know. Oh, my sister in here. They got my brother, my sister. Y'all stop. I don't even nobody know who y'all is, girl. Stop. Hush. People all be on your business like that. That'd be your business. But, um, yeah. They go that corn. Yes, the corn comes straight on out. Corn don't take girl a corn. All oh, corn. That's how you know. Ain't corn a hybrid? Ain't corn man made or not? Does corn? No, corn come from a seed. So it's not a hybrid, right? Because corn is a seed. Anything from a seed is real. Okay. Corn be coming out in like twenty minutes. <laughs> Corn to come out in an hour. You'd be like, ooh, that's that whole corn on the cob. <laughs> corn and lettuce. Lettuce be coming out. You'd be like, ooh, look at that cabbage. Is it weird? Is it weird? Because, you know, I used to always think it was weird to, like, hold on. Hold on, y'all. Wait a minute. Oh, shit. Where's my wallet? Oh, Lord. I ain't got no money. Let me see if I can charm them. Hold on. <clears throat> that look good? Okay. Did that work? Because I ain't got no money. Hey, yeah. I, I left my wallet <laughs> at home. I left my wallet at home, girl. I'll pay for you, I'm just like, oh, she was gonna pay for me. No, I got it. <laughs> I was just on my live, like, what if I bat my eyes and say I left my wallet? What they think? <laughs> yeah, girl, I ain't wash my face. If you see a little cold, just filter it. Okay. <laughs> Hey friend, what's going on? She is so pretty. Got her lashes in it all. Look at <laughs> Thank you, boo. Rudy, hey. Thank you so much. Oh, just that little lemonade. All right, thank you, friend. You too. Mmm, you still look cold. Just, you know, filter it, girl. I ain't watch my face. Y'all, I think COVID be having like reactions and stuff. Like I had COVID before and now it's like the symptoms will come back sometimes. Like my, well, no, let me not say that because y'all gonna be like, you got COVID. No, like I could taste and smell and stuff. But like my tongue, my tongue be numb sometimes. Did you get your car? You know I did. <laughs> Don't play me about my corn. Mm, oh boy, I'm ready to eat. Mm, this is just sad. I'm killing myself. This is so sad. This is so sad. What's your favorite drink? I'm just, this is sad. And taste it but like it just that COVID be fucking us up it's like I can taste it but it's like you can taste it taste it like if you can taste it too much does that make any sense 
Like I can really taste it. Like it's a I, I know that sound weird. Like you can it's like your tongue is real sensitive. No, y'all, I got tested for COVID when I went to go do the <sighs> breathe though. Don't get mad at people. See, people don't listen. That's what's wrong with folks. They don't listen. I said, I think COVID be having after effects on folks. That's exactly what I said. Isn't that what I said? That's what I said, right? I said, it be having after effects. Like when you take a pill and it says your side effects are going to be this. I think COVID has like lifelong after effects. I said that. That's what I said. That's what I said. Hmm. I think it has lifelong after effects. Like. Ever since I had had it or whatever, because like mind you, I've been tested recently because I had to go do a um, had to go do a shooting with Cam Newton, and I was negative. Um, but it's like my tongue gets really sensitive. Like you know, like <laughs> I use this as an example. You know when you get drunk and you drink. You know when you get drunk and you drink and then like every you start touching stuff, it feels different. Like you like, ooh, you can really feel it. It's like that. Like I can really. I don't like it. Like I can really feel the food on my tongue. I can taste it. Like I don't know. It's weird. It's weird. Um, there has been a research about long-term symptoms. I spit him. Yeah, like, it's hard to explain. It feels like my tongue is really smooth. <laughs> Girl, your tongue is smooth already. You know what I mean. Heightened. Yes, it's heightened my senses. Like, it feels like, it feels like my tongue is like, just like <laughs> I don't know. Shut up. Shut the oh Lord, don't waste the fries. Jesus. Oh God, I'm wasting my power. Um uh -huh. They're trying to adjust. It'll be that way for a while. No, I had it a while. Is that pop smoke? I mean <laughs> pop honey? Yeah, that's his little ugly ass child. He be dipping in and dipping out, child. He's so fake. He's not a real friend, girl. Don't talk to him, girl. He is, child, he is not a real friend, honey. They said your tongue working overtime. <laughs> shit, shit the fuck up. Somebody said, not that smiling. <laughs> First of all, I don't do drugs, Miss Thane. Don't do me, girl. Ooh, let's see. Ooh. Let's see. I'm just trying to figure out what's going on with my system. See? It's good. Oh, these are some good um tenders. You ain't like the um oh that little mushy though. That little soggy. It was good at first, but that's a little soggy soggy. Mmm. I don't know. That's a 50 50. Like, I like it and I don't. Girl, I like it and I don't like it. That smacking. Girl, you gotta smack to really taste something. If you don't really smack, is it the oral spray? Oh! <gasps> I did buy, no not that spray I did buy this spray that you spray in your mouth oh it might have fucked up my spitting it might have messed up my senses oh my god where that spray at let me see if it got side effects 
Where is it? It's this spray because like, you know, when you go in the club and you drink, I got me some mouth spray because I don't like the, you know, I don't like people to come up and talk to me when I got liquor breath. Cause you know, liquor breath is so disgusting. It, it's just gross. And I don't like liquor breath. So I spray this stuff in my mouth. And I think ever since I got that stuff, it done fucked up my senses. It ain't that oral spray. Wait, what spray, what spray was it? I can use it on my ex. <laughs> Go watch my YouTube video. No, but I got it out of I got it out of Walmart. It was like a oral spray for like when you you know want to make make your breath fresh. But no, the other one is something I got from a sex though. It really don't work. It just feel like you put chloroceptin in your mouth. It was like you put chloroceptin in your mouth and it like numb your throat. But it don't like stop your gagging. Um, but oh, this is so mushy. Oh my god, what's on this batter? Oh, this batter is so not good. This is this is oh my god, this is so poorly prepared. Hmm. It smell a little soggy. Just that light chicken. You know how you put up under the light? I don't know. I'm just hungry, girl. I am just hungry. Ah! Have you ever ate soggy bread? It's like you eating soggy bread with some meat on the middle of it. I don't know. How you gonna say it's mushy but keep eating because the bitch is hungry, child? When you hungry, you will eat anything. Child, at this point, uh-oh. I know they lying. Oh, I know they lying. What is that? I think it's the cup. I know they lying. What is that? It's like a little, oh, I know they lying. What is that? The cup? Oh, it might be the pole. Oh, no, that's, oh, I know they lying. Oh, Jesus. Hold on. What is that? I got to pray over it. <laughs> Man, with something in the cup. <laughs> Women can't please them. But though you a nigga, don't bitch, don't try me. Women, you can't please us. We get so mad about everything. Just we want everything to be so perfect. Dear Lord, I come to you as humbly as possible with my arms open wide and my, and my body as a vessel. I need you to please bless this lemonade because I really want to drink it because my mouth is feeling real parched right now because that food is really nasty. And I know there was some stuff in it, but everything on this earth is made by you. Even the, ooh, I'm, I got a peek. Even the lint. So whatever that was in this cup, I ask that you remove it, remove its poison because I'm not trying to get COVID for the fifth time. I had it four times. I know I've been going out in Georgia. Georgia ain't never closed. I'm sorry. Should have been listening, but it's okay. But I'm all right. Clean this stuff. Clean my cup and make it nourish my soul and be good for my body to make me strong and have a wonderful day. I know it's lemonade, but lemonade can make it strong because then it gives you that liquid that needs to go in your body. Your body already produces water, but I need that lemonade. All right, because I don't want to throw it out. Spit my coin on it. It's like a little good 150. So um, please, dear Lord Jesus, bless it, bless it, bless it. And in your name, bless it because I'm sure going to drink it. Amen. Amen. And amen. See? Ew. Water. What was that? I just 
just knew it was gonna be you know like i just knew <laughs> i knew it was gonna hit me right here and i'm gonna be like oh that's so sweet child horrible this whole meal i'm over it Over it. Guess I gotta eat the chicken. <laughs> Lord have mercy, Jesus. I ain't mad. I'm just disappointed. I was really looking forward to that lemonade. Why are you just like, <laughs> good? You know what? Let me go see if my friend got some lick over there. Hold on. Let me see if my friend got a little margarita. Hold on. I'm just, you know what? Let me go to my little friend. She sell margarita at her wing shop. Hold on. Uh oh, what I done hit? Oh, that's a little bit of that ice. She sell margaritas at her little wing shop. Hold on, let me go get me some margarita. Hold on. I'm not gonna be drunk in the morning. Ooh, these fries is good though. They real like potato eat. This is a fresh potato. Well, it's a good potato. Not too much salt, not too much nothing. This is so good. Hold on. Let me go see. Go on, honey. Okay, let me see. Not day drinking, child. This happy hour. I ain't ha no, happy hours at what, four? I'm gonna get my margarita, girl. Mm. You heard the wings good? Yo, the wings here in Atlanta be real good, girl. They be so good. Zo, what's going on with... Oh, girl. I don't know. I don't know. This is why we need a... <laughs> right. You ready, brunch? <laughs> The music. Y'all can hear the music? Y'all can hear the music? It's not connected, is it? Y'all can hear the music? Church song. Oh my god, relax. Mm -mm. You try this time again. I'm gonna call this girl. It was always a whole entertainment girl. I just be chilling, eating on the beat, right? Come on! I just want a little daiquiri. Well, to the one. It is a oh, this is a gospel song. Take it, 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 take it,
out the way, move speed with track star on Atlanta. I know what hit by station at home. She's a runner, she's a track star. <laughs> she's a runner, she's a track star. I like that little song, girl. <laughs> He's like, I, <laughs> I, I promise you, I do that every time that song come on. I start running, girl. I just be on the run. <laughs> Don't know where I'm going to. I just run. I run up the steps. Oh, he is fine. Y'all look who's working here. Y'all look, ladies. Look, 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 look. Hold on. Wait, y'all. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, look, 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 look. Look, 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 look. Ooh, woo. look at the little, 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 Ooh, his hands is big too. Oh my God. Damn, my turn. Well, I think he saw me get myself together. Hold on. Hey, is um my friend here, the lady? Which one? The one who be running it. Which one? You talking about the drink? The one who sell the drinks. I can't. Oh, so this is your spot. This is not your spot. What you mean? That's my GT out there. That don't mean nothing. That's a 2021. Okay, it's still ugly. <laughs> no. Hey, it's always got jokes. <laughs> <laughs> look. So, where's my ticket? You look so different. That's you? You done cleaned up nicely. Y'all ladies, look at him. You can get your <laughs> husband. <laughs> no, right? <laughs> Oh Lord, she might have heard everything I said. Hey. Don't tell her. Oh, so I came. I just came to get me my daiquiri, and she's gone. I hit her up. You know uh uh, that's. I needed it now. I hit her. She stayed down on West Chapel. That's far. Well, and I down that way. You don't know where I stay. On the south side, so what? Lie. Oh my God. Why not just start it back? Right, well, not the show show, just the TV show. Oh, so y'all still ain't letting nobody come in there? You don't watch social media. I don't. I work too hard, bro. The show was canceled for a minute. I don't know. You work too hard. That's how you got that GT. 21. Let's switch cars. No, I don't want that five on the ID. Lie. So you don't know what's under my hood. I lead it. What, you this point on? Lie. That shit ain't nothing. I lead it. That super boost. <laughs> I got one too. It don't it's still sad. Is somebody behind me? Okay. Well, let me go. You. I'm going to come back. All right. No, I wanted my drink. I don't want it no more. No, he's so goddamn fine. Look at his Jeep. Ah! Look at his GT. Oh, I'm such a flirt. Five flaring. Oh, I got five flaring. Y'all. Yeah. That man, no, he fine. That man, no, he is fine, girl. Oh, my God. Ugh. She's a runner. She's a track star. And I'm running. <laughs> He's like, <laughs> and girl, y'all is stupid. He looks so different. Oh, I don't scratch myself. Lord have mercy. I don't beat myself up worried about a man. He looks so different. At first, he was a little ugly. Oh, what happened? He not oh, he must, oh. I don't think he had that beard cut. Who is that? I don't think he had that beard cut and he had that little mask on. Now he got that mask off. His teeth look good. His beard is nice. His dress is good. Oh! I think I'm hungry. I want some wings. <laughs> oh, fine too. Oh, Jesus. Okay, stop being a hoe though. See, I'm a runner. She's a runner. She's a track star. She gonna run away when it gets hard. I surely do. But, um, Lord have mercy. I'm just, oh, I wanted my drink. Hey, y'all, what's going on? He said his old lady. Oh, I like when men say that, my old lady. 
you know, my old lady, she be watching you. She do. <laughs> do you watch me? My old lady be watching you, you know what I'm saying? What? So can I be your little lady? <laughs> I can be little lady. She can be old lady. Little lady. That sound cute. Little lady. What's up? What you doing? Nothing. Come see me. I'm at work. What time you going, man? Three. All right, I'm going to push up. What you want? You want to eat? Because I know you don't want to eat no more than wings. What you want? Bring me some on um, Zach's. Okay, what you want? A little kicking chicken meal. Yeah. <laughs> Extra sauce on the sandwich. Got it. Let me get ready to get on off and let y'all enjoy y'all day. I done got my breakfast, but it wasn't good. <laughs> Jesus. I just knew it was going to be good. Breakfast was not good this morning. Damn, that's why I need to learn how to cook. Oh, I got some Eggos at the house. I got some Eggos and I got some syrup. It's 12 o'clock, though. It's time for some fish. Who living at oh god another fine one? Who live in at who live in Atlanta? Because there's a place called Sudos and you need to go there, y'all. I promise I ain't never had no shrimp. Let me pull over in this parking lot because I don't want y'all to know where I live at because some folks is crazy. They are oh, are they out here playing basketball? You know, these men be out here playing basketball early in the morning. They be trying to fight too. Let me just park. Okay, so um there's this place called I'm finna go home. There's this place called Sudos, right? Y'all really need to go to Sudos. It's so good. Order the, um, go to the one over there. Fayetteville, I think. I don't know. Um, their shrimp is so good. They put, like, some type of hot sauce on it. And it's freaking amazing. I've never had no shrimp that good. And then you get it with this broccoli. Their broccoli is real. Their broccoli is seasoned real good. And you get you some rice. Oh, my God. <clears throat> it's so good. Grits and shrimp. Uh-uh, that sent me to the bathroom. I think it'd be the grits. Because, you know, I think people put milk in their grits. Like, anything with milk, anything with milk, it's coming out of me. Oh, it's in Ellenwood. My cousins, it's in Ellenwood. Okay, everybody. Ellenwood, Ellenwood, Ellenwood. <laughs> Damn, y'all work out? <laughs> Golly. Okay. <laughs> Good God. What about Juicy Crab? Girl, I don't already. Everybody know I like Juicy Crab, boo. Pregnant and hungry. Me too. Right, girl, I was going to say me too. The whole line. <laughs> but yeah. But yeah, Sudos is really good. It's over there in Illinois. It's really good. My cousin took me for the first time like a week ago. And bitch, I done been there three times already. <laughs> Album. You know what else is good in Georgia? Uh, look, I just love food, y'all. I love food. I need to learn how to cook. It's this place called New Orleans Daiquiri, child. Over there um, off of Old National Now, if you ain't hood, then you don't need to go there because, you know, I like to go to hood spots. I love hood spots. It's just me. I like it. The vibe be good. DJs be good. And the food be good. Seasoned real well. But it's called New Orleans Daiquiri over there off of Old National. Oh, girl, that's my Spot, girl. I got that good old jambalaya. That jambalaya was blessed, blessed. They could have added a little bit more shrimp in there, though, but they was being real stingy, you know. And then they got that gator meat. That gator meat is good, too, there. They get, and they drinks. <sighs> Their drinks are so good. You ever been to Hot and Juicy? Ooh, that sound good. Somebody said the drinks so cheap. Yes, they drinks is on point, baby. Spun divots is bone too. Oh, see, I never been there, but I heard about it. I heard about Raph, but I never been there either, friend. I went um to this other place on Old National Cousin. What was it called? We went to um Madhouse. Ooh! Mmm! 
Madhouse? If you want to go home and forget your name and then just walk in the house and throw your husband on the bed? Oh, my God. Those drinks is something stupid, baby. You going to... Girl? Baby, Madhouse ain't no joke. You know who else is a nice little spot? You know what's a nice little spot? If you want to get drunk, drunk, now y'all listen to me. Now hear me out. Y'all going to get scared because when you Google them, it's going to say they done had a couple of shootings out there. <laughs> So just make sure you go there with your tennis shoes on. <laughs> and go there with your tennis shoes on and make sure you got some running gear because you need to know how to run because they done had a couple of shootings there. But the drinks are stupid good, okay? It's over there um, near Stonecrest Mall. Cousin, what's it called? Um, It's called uh, Ballpark or something. It's called, um, oh, what's it called? Um, back door. What's it called? Ballpark. The clubhouse. What's it called? Where my crew at? They in here. Um, what's it called? It's over there by um, Stone Chris Mall. Ah, oh, shit. No, I'm for real. When y'all Google, you gonna see the bomb. I got to clap because the drinks be so good. <laughs> I had to give him a round of applause because the drinks be so good. The bomb? Baby. Bitch. Dim drinks at the bomb over there by Stonecrest Mall? Oh, girl. Oh, girl. I was fucked up off of two. I had my cousin them, they drink. Now they she can drink, but girl, when she had to ask for some more juice in her drink, <laughs> oh girl, your drink is strong, girl. The bomb is so good. See, I told you. <laughs> <laughs> the bomb is so good, y'all. But it's it's ratchet, girl. It's it's ratchet. But it's good. But it's ratchet, girl. It's the after hour spot. So, everybody who is drunk coming from the other clubs, they gonna go to the bomb. And the bomb don't close till like 4 and 6 o'clock in the morning. Ain't nothing good happening at 4 and 6 o'clock in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. Um, so, if you want to have a nice time with some action, go there. Because it's the shooting for me. No, they don't shoot all the time. It's just they've had a couple of run-ins at the bomb because it does close at like four six o'clock in the morning and you know once you up that long drinking and smoking ain't nothing good happening at that time but it's good it the bomb is really good it's over there by stone chris mall y'all should try it's really good so i told y'all the bomb i told you madhouse on old national i told you um louisiana or new orleans daiquiri on, on old national see i'm always in the hood y'all i'm sorry that's just what i like um, the one off of Ellenwood, that's, uh, pseudos. It's enough. Crave. Crave? East Atlanta, where I live? Stump the ground? Crave? Crave is it. I love Crave. I love Crave. And they hookahs are always really good. Their hookahs are good at Crave. I love Crave. And who else got good hookahs is, um, who else got good hookahs is, uh, what's that place, cousin? Um, ha is it Harold's? When we sit outside, I think that's Harold's. Crave is so good. They had one here in Macon. Yeah, Crave is really good. Uh-uh, Crave is still on East Atlanta, friend. It's still there, baby. It's right there, honey. Crave is still there. Look at that five points. I want to go to America. <laughs> <laughs> but, um, Harold's, Seavers. No, that's the one over there in Kennesaw. 
I'm talking about Harold's when we sat outside. Harold's when we sat outside. Oh, that's, you know, where the girls, she, she threw up. <laughs> that's Harold's. And they got some good chicken. Oh, that chicken. Y'all, and I don't really eat chicken like that. Y'all, yeah, I don't like um fried chicken like that. But, baby, Harold's chicken over there. um, Where's that at? In uh, Edgewood? I think that's where we was at. Edgewood. Harold's on Edgewood. Ain't that it? I think that's it. Yes! Oh! Harold's on Edgewood. Woo! That's the hood, too, girl. That's the hood, too. That's where all the men be at. Because we went to this place called Ghost Bar. And just the other day, Ghost Bar got shot up. Oh, my God. Where I be hanging out at? Oh, Jesus. Ghost Bar done got shot up. All them hood niggas be in there, too. When I went to Ghost Bar, I was like, oh, this is this is like a house party. Child. Ooh, take me around the niggas. I want to go out tonight. <laughs> Let's go to go smart. <laughs> Let's go to go smart. They was just shooting over there last night. <laughs> um, but yeah, Harold. I mean, Ghost Bar is real ratchet, girl. So I love when he said, "Oh my God, yeah, girl." It's just. I be going out. Like, I go to sidebars. I don't really, like, go to, like, where everybody go. I don't like that. I don't like that. This chicken. It's getting better now. It's just getting a little... It's done... Oh, I'm spit. It's done set out for a minute, so it's getting a little hard. <laughs> okay, y'all. Let me go. Oh, but, yeah, y'all need to try Stevens, too. I think it's S-I-B-A-S over there in Kennesaw. See, I don't want to tell everybody my places they going to go. In Kennesaw? S-I-B-A-S, Stevens. In Kennesaw? That's the spot. You got Puerto Rican, black, white, gay, straight, masculine, thug, rich, Everybody be in there. Everybody. Hookahs be on point. Service is good. Food is good. Them lamb in there is... Ooh, the lamb in there is good. Oh, my God. Everything in there is so good. Cirque is good. I think it's C-I-R-Q-U-E. Cirque. Oh, that's good. Oh, that's good. They got this thing called crab knuckles. I ain't never know you can get no crab knuckles, y'all. I've never heard of crab knuckles. What crab knuckles is, is basically the claw of the crab. That's all they serve you is the claw, right? And I didn't know that. And it's already, it's already stripped. So all you got to do is just dip it and eat the meat. And I didn't know that. So I went to Cirque and baby, I ordered about three orders of crab knuckles. I ordered three servings of crab knuckles. So good. And then on top of that, if you go on Tuesday, oh yeah, crab claws. Oh, I said crab knuckles. It's crab claws. Whatever the fuck it is, crab knuckle, crab claws. You know what I'm talking about. It's good. I ordered three servings of those. And then if you go on Tuesday, the um daiquiris are only five dollars, I think. Five or ten dollars the most. And you can just get as many as you want all night. You put the little wristband on, and baby, they just bring you drink after drink after drink after drink after drink after drink until you say stop. As long as you don't say stop, girl, they're gonna keep bringing it, girl. My little thing finna fall. Lord have mercy. She drunk. She must have went out on Tuesday. She still drunk. Crab claws, y'all. That's not knuckles. Oh my God. Is that hot in Georgia? My little thing is falling off. Oh my Lord. Have mercy. What is going on? Oh my God. She is. She is really over it. She is. 
work out. Oh, come on, sis. <coughs> it's okay. <coughs> oh, my, I ain't even had you for a whole six months. Oh, my, oh, Jesus. Okay. Where you at, Creek? Girl, over here at this park where, um, at this park by my house where they be saying the folks be in the woods doing the grown up stuff and they fought in that path no more. I don't go on that path no more. I'm scared. But they say they be out there doing all the hoochie coochie in the little park. And I see it's one, two, three, four, five cars out here, but I don't see nobody on the swing sets, nobody on the tennis court, basketball court, nobody over there sitting on the benches. But they sure probably is on that little path back there. I ain't going. I'll see y'all in a minute. <laughs> I ain't going. Because it's all these cars, but I don't see nobody. Nobody, baby. I don't know where they at, though. I ain't going in there. They in the woods. That snake's in the woods. I ain't going in the woods. They in there, too. You know what park I'm talking about? Cool Tyler. Cause I googled it, cause you know my um I had went walking one day when I was walking my dog, and I had put it on my Instagram story, and then my brother hit me up, cause you know his friend does real estate, and he was like, tell your brother he might not want to go in that trail because they be in there doing inappropriate stuff, and I and then we don't want nothing to happen to him. They snatch him up, and I girl when he said that bitch, I grabbed my dog and we scooted and booted. <laughs> <laughs> girl, we scooted and booted it, girl. I said, come on, Kip. We got to go. <laughs> uh-uh, not Piedmont Park. I said, we, they do that there, too. I said, come on, Kip. We got to go. <laughs> girl, I think I ran faster than him. <laughs> but anyway, it's not Monday, but let's get messy, right? Yeah, child. Uh-uh, baby. This the, cruise, this the cruising spot. I don't go out there, girl. I know exactly where you at. How you know? Never mind. Never mind. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> I don't even want to know. Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> you so stupid child yeah girl mm lord how much it is mm 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 well that's that all right, y'all. Let me go. It's 12.45. Let me go start my day. I don't know what I'm about to do. So what you eating? Child, some dirty wings from Hardee's. I usually... I should have got the sandwich. That's what I usually get. And their sandwiches be really good. But um, I think Hardee's has better breakfast than they do lunch. The breakfast is not really good. The lunch is good, but the breakfast isn't good to me. You know what I said I wanted to do, y'all? I need to stop saying what I want to do and just do it. That's my problem. I came up with so many ideas, but I never follow through. I always, like, I am I need to take Tyler Perry's advice where he said, don't wait to be set at the table. Create your own table and let them want to sit with you. That's what I need to do. But, um, I, uh-oh. Who done found me? Oh, Lord, they know where the cruise park at. They done found me. They going cruising. I be having to watch because y'all folks be knowing where I'm at. But anyway, um, I said, and this is an idea I had came up with a long time ago. Because I like to eat so much, I love eating, right? I love eating. People love the way I describe food and talk about food when I eat. Like when I be doing my mukbangs and stuff. I said... I think I need to go around the world. But, you know, first start off in Atlanta. 
ask people what are the number one spots to eat at in Atlanta? What are the number one spots to eat at in New York? What are the number one spots to eat at in Houston? And I go there and I could become a food critic. Like the comedy food critic. So whenever anybody see me walk into their store, they're going to be like, oh, y'all, Zoe in here. This shit got to be good. Because, baby, he finna record. Give him the best plate. Make sure you season it right. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. Make sure you season it right. Make sure you do this. Because I want to be able to walk in and be like, oh, girl, he finna cr cr um, critique our food. Bitch, I go off, LOL, bro. Let's do the noodles challenge. <laughs> She over here talking about noodles and we talking about food. <laughs> she just hungry, hungry. <laughs> she hungry, hungry. Because y'all know I tell the truth about some food. Because I love to eat. I love to eat. <laughs> oh, boy. I love to eat. <laughs> um, But, yeah... I be having good ideas, girl. And even if somebody steal it, it ain't gonna execute the way it would if I was doing this. That's why I don't be caring about saying my ideas because really, it ain't gonna hit the same without that Zoe flavor. You feel me? Why is everybody pulling up? Something ain't right. Are y'all? Oh, they go to Caucasians. They in on it too? Oh. Oh, look, 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 look. Where they going? Where they going? Where they going? This is really something. Mm, Lord have mercy, Jesus. I ain't got nothing to do. If it ain't about me, <laughs> let's kiki <key> next cast. <laughs> if it ain't about me, mm, it ain't nobody business. You better leave. Oh, wrap it up. <laughs> they picking up, right? <laughs> Don't look, just run. Right, y'all. Okay. Yeah, let me go. It was fun talking to y'all this morning. You won't, oh, y'all don't believe me. I don't be lying. I be for real. Let me show y'all. See, look, she pulled up beside me. Oh, she might be watching, so let me put her on camera. So, look, there go one car. See, she in the way. Let me back up. Hold on. Let me back up and show y'all. Hold on. Oh, that was my air. I got scared. I said, oh, Lord, somebody attacking. So let me show y'all, hold on. So look, they go one car, two car, three car, four car, five car, and they go to um, Caucasians. But look, there's nobody in sight. Where the people at? Hold on, let me show you. Where the people? Where are the people? There's no people anywhere. I don't see nobody, but I see all these cars. Look, she already taking her little shirt halfway down. Look at it. Look. Oh, no, they got a baby. They ain't going to do nothing. They got a baby. They probably going to just let her play on the playground. See, they coming here doing what they're supposed to do. But where everybody else at? Lord have mercy, Jesus. This is really something. This world is really something. <laughs> this world is really something. Have a great day. <laughs> That's a whole lot, a whole lot of... It's lunchtime. Lunch, hunch, lunch and hunch. <laughs> they jogging. No, I'm telling They might be jogging for real. But it is said, like, if you go on the website, if you go on Google and type in cruise parks in Atlanta. Oh, Lord, I thought y'all was looking at me. Jesus Christ. I'm sorry. If you go on Google and type in cruise parks in Atlanta, this one going to pop up right along with Piedmont Park. Um, uh, Hartsville, J the airport, they're gonna tell you to go to level so and so, so and so, and they always doing it in that bathroom. On, I think it's like on Concourse C or something like that. I don't know. Don't, I don't, don't ask me how I know. But at the airport, you gotta go to Concourse something and go to this bathroom, and they be in there just doing a whole lot, a whole lot of, I don't know. a whole lot, a whole lot of. <laughs> Somebody said the invasion of the body snatch, y'all. That's where you at? <laughs> because it's a, it's right here by my house. So I always park here. I don't ever drive all the way home on live. Because people really be watching your background. And they know exactly where you be at. 
because um one time I headed to um what was where did I go? I went somewhere. It's happened a couple of times. I'd be on live and people will pull up to where I'm at and they'll be like, I saw you on live, so I don't ever drive all the way home on live. No ma'am, girl. Not because I don't trust y'all, but you know, you never know. It might be some people who just just don't like you. So yeah. I don't drive home on live, girl. You never know. If it ain't about me, well, I can't really win away, friend. Do you still energy? <laughs> friend, I never finished it. I never finished it, friend, because it was soggy, but never so a little bit. Leave me alone. Damn, it's my chicken. If I want to eat it tonight, I'm going to eat it tonight. <laughs> Dang. Worried about when I eat my chicken. Hey. <laughs> Leave me alone. I'm going to eat it tomorrow. Let me say that last little piece of chicken for tomorrow. Eat that in the morning. <laughs> I'm going to eat that in the morning. Wrap it up. Take that on to the house. <laughs> I ain't worried about my piece of chicken. Y'all crazy. Y'all crazy. And she said, damn, you still eating that chicken? <laughs> you still eating that chicken? <laughs> Y'all, I burnt my little stomach yesterday. I burnt my stomach Um, I, when I was um saging the house. I was just going like this where I was sitting down saging. Oh, Lord. I was sitting down saging. And you know, sometimes when you blow the sage, the stuff will fall. Well, it, fall, it fell on my shirt. And I was just like, oh, I smell it. <laughs> I was saging and I blew it. I said, and I guess a little piece of um fire fell on, on my on my shirt. And I was like, mm, I smell a I smell a smoke. <laughs> because it was burning through my shirt and I didn't know it. And I was just like <laughs> I started scratching. <laughs> oh, it's a little stinky down there. I look, I said, oh! I got a little whelp. I got a little whelp right here on my stomach. Oh, Lord. And got me. <laughs> I think that was that little demon. She was trying to make me put the sage out, but girl, I kept on saging. I surely did. That one one burn ain't gonna stop me. I kept going. Ooh. Got me a little blister, but I'm all right. <laughs> I'm all right, but no, I was like, oh, something is burning. What is burning there? <laughs> I thought it was connected with the spirits or something. I said, oh, girl, it is frying these motherfuckers. They finna be up out of here. They cooking. I thought that was something new. I was like, oh, girl, it is cooking the spirits. I said, it is up out. But then, girl, my shirt was on fire. How that little show, how that little lady said it? I smell the fire. I said, oh, Lord, it's the fire. <laughs> That's what I said. Jesus Christ, Lord have mercy. It's the fire. But yeah, y'all. Anyway. Y'all so stupid. And girl, get some coconut butter. Mm -mm, I'm all right. Um, I'm okay. It's good. It's just like a little smaller. Oh, that's what I need to go do. Get me my bite. 